Hi, I'm Dan Patrick. It's unfortunate that we find ourselves in a third special session. We should have and could have completed our work many weeks ago. But if we are spending millions of taxpayer dollars being in a third special session, then let's make it count. Now is the time to pass legislation conservatives have supported for years on illegal immigration, campus carry, school choice, and C-Scope. The C-Scope lesson plans are no longer being sold to schools, and that should have ended the issue. But a lawyer and some zealous C-Scope supporters have said they can still use them. Now, I disagree. Eventually, a court may have to decide the issue, but we can resolve the issue with additional legislation I filed in the last special session and have filed again in this special session, legislation that would end C-Scope lesson plans for good. The lieutenant governor recently told conservatives he would push for more legislation in 2015 to close down C-Scope lesson plans once and for all. Why wait? Let's pass it now. This week, the lieutenant governor told a school choice crowd he would pass school choice in 2015, even if he had to bend the rules. Why wait? We don't have to bend the rules in a special session. Let's pass it now. I filed my school choice bills in the last special session and again in this third special session. The Senate passed the Sanctuary City Bill last session, but it failed in the House. Why wait until 2015? Let's pass it now. I filed that bill. And Campus Carry, it was stopped in this last regular session by the 21 vote rule, which doesn't apply in a special session. Why wait? Let's pass it now. Conservatives have supported these issues in the past, and the lieutenant governor says he will again in two years. I say, why wait? We can pass these bills now out of the Senate and send them to the House. I've requested that Governor Perry put all of these issues on the call, and I'm asking for the lieutenant governor to follow my lead and make the same request. We can have all these bills on the Senate floor in a week and send them to the House with plenty of time to pass. It's time for the lieutenant governor to stop making promises about what he might do in 2015 and join with me to pass these bills now out of the Senate. There is really no excuse. This is good legislation for Texas. We have the majority. Conservative voters want this legislation passed, and we have the time. Why wait? Let's pass these bills now. Go to my website and join with other conservatives encouraging the governor and lieutenant governor to add these issues to the third special session call. The lieutenant governor has had six legislative sessions, nearly 12 years in office, to get these issues passed. Now he's asking for another two years. The time for waiting for conservatives is over. Let's get it done now.